Hello everybody and um, you may be wondering um, exactly what happened and where I am and what is this texture pack. Well, um, let's be honest, Homecraft was a bust. So I decided that I was going to show you what I have made in progress of another world and then continue on to it. So as you can see I have enchanted diamond armor, I also have enchanted diamond boots. But I managed to get feather falling on these iron ones, so I'm using those instead. And I also have the sword and this pickaxe, which I'm very happy with. Um, I have some random stuff in here. Um, I just got back from the nether, actually. I managed to get a brewing stand. I'm not really sure what I'll use it for. But yeah, I should probably put my stuff in here from the nether. I'll have you know that I do have cheap inventory and all that stuff on. Yeah, see here are my diamond boots. And then I have a power one bone here. Uh, this is my valuables chest that is getting kind of full. So I'm probably going to make that into a double chest at some point. Um, they add a brewing chest somewhere. <laughs> Oh my god, I can put it there. Alright. Alright, so this is actually the house that I built. Um, well, you might be happy to know that I built this house myself and did not use cheats. And so I'm pretty good. So, yeah, the only thing I've used cheats for so far is to um, explore the area when I first logged on to make sure that it wasn't just an island because I, spawn I spawned on an island and I was making sure that it wasn't just an island and keep inventory. So, yeah. Brewing. But my magma cream. Oh, what? Um, whoops, where is my axe? And I wanted to use this texture pack, and, um, oh, dang it. I had to use a older version to use it because the newer updates of it were not working. So, that happened. Food and drops. Mm. Now let's not put a um, sign on there. Uh, oh, I have cast tears actually. Where's my <laughs> Sorry, there are my cast tears. I got those off of the zombie pigment. Oh, I have <laughs> This chest. Cool. I will show you everything once I get my inventory. You know what? Let's. Oh wait, no. All right. So I'm working on currently getting an enchantment se section here, so I can get some more stuff. Um. And I'm working on getting enough diamonds to be able to um, combine once I get my enchantment table up and all that. And the sun. Oh, I made a little like viewing section at the back because, yeah, the sunset. See? Isn't that pretty? Oh, I love it so much. Ah, I just like to sit here most of the time, watch the sunset. Also, I'm pretty sure that there is a cave underneath this house. Whoop. It's, it's clearly not just that it's below the horizon at this point. Thank you. Probably a cave under my house. But, anyways. Um... I have a nice view of this little bay here that looks onto some birch trees, and I'm a big fan of birch, so I'm happy about it. All right, here is my house. The roof is a little wonky looking, but um, 
I'm not really good with roofing. Like, usually I just use slabs and it's a flat, oh, flat roof. Mm. With this. That's sections. All right. And if we go over here, um, I have uh, my, my horse. Uh, this is my horse, Llama. Don't ask. And I have some sheep in here. And I originally had, like, a little hut right here. And, and I was going to build here, but I walked over to get some sand for windows over there because I was too lazy to go <laughs> because I didn't want to ruin that place because I was going to, um, what you call it, build my house here. Really lazy, <laughs> even though that's, I, I don't know why, but I did and I was like, hey, wait a minute, that's a lot better a view. And I was just like, okay, let's build there. And I did. So there is some evidence. You can see torches all over the place where I lit it up from mobs. And my sugarcane farm over here, which I should probably get. What? I'm working on books, so I need paper. Under. But anyways, yeah, this is what I have so far in the world. And I've literally called this, what did I call this world? I forgot what I called this one. Red. Well, it'll be the title of these of this episode. Uh, I will title the episode the title of this world. So, oh yeah, it was called the mine because I was like planning on doing this on myself and stuff. And in here I have a lot of leather, and I have some more sugar cane. Do that. Should we look and do that? And do that. And put that there. And I have two more books. Uh, did I put, do I have extra books in here? Um, yes, I did. Now I can make another bookshelf. It's very slow progress, but I've been slowly, um, filling my enchantment section here we go one thing I also noticed is that no matter where the player stands the book always turns to face the player and I never noticed that before probably because the only time I've been playing Minecraft really has been on um, what's it called pocket edition where it's like really laggy and stuff so whoop. That, 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 uh, there. Alright, so I think I'm gonna go back to the nether and work on getting some nether quartz to make a little barn. I've been collecting some wool. I don't really have that much yet, but I will be needing nether quartz. I want to make a little barn and have my animals in it. And I have my nether pool over here because I know that it makes a lot of noise and stuff. There we go. I didn't bring any blocks, but this and part of the nether has already been pretty much explored by me. Also, it's really hard to see nether quartz in my texture pack. Um, um, Like, it's pretty easy to distinguish among all the patterns of the same, but it's, like, exactly the same color and all that. And it has kind of the same so look at it in this texture pack before I switch to show you. Oh, God, there's a ghast. Oh, oh, God. Okay. Um, oh, dang it. That didn't work. Come back here. You're just gonna come back up at me. Mm. I swear to God, if you make me destroy something, I will kill you. Mm. Better at aiming them. No. Get back here. You have terrible aim. Mm. Kill you. 
Bats are pretty stupid, actually. I figured that out. And I'm still not seeing any nether. Oh! <gasps> to have <laughs> so they're falling on your boots. I react really slowly to that because I just get like so shocked. No, we are in some nether quartz. It's all around here, trust me. Ah, here. Nether quartz. Very difficult to locate in the texture pack because when you're looking at it from far away, it doesn't pop out like it normally would because of the coloring of it. Uh, oh, here's some more. The only reason I'm finding it right now is because I'm actually looking for it. And I know what you're thinking. I'm probably being very um, nonchalant about digging up. In the nether, but usually if there's lava above somewhere, it like drips down and I have particles on, so. Up oh, top! See, it would have walked right by that. All right, I think I'm gonna turn off the texture pack. Done, and it's loading. Oh gosh, Minecraft is ugly. <laughs> oh god. But yeah, you see, you wouldn't have been, I, there's like nether quartz all over this place and you wouldn't have been able to see it because, oh shoot, I need to eat. <laughs> I should probably like get a mod, like, I should get the inventory pets mod because um, they have one pet that is, um, what is it? Is, but... It feeds you when you're hungry, so you don't have to worry about that. And yes, this is why I should have brought blocks. And I didn't bring blocks. So I'm just going to block off this. Holy, but surely it will deplete. Anyways, I'm going to get this vein and the vein that was at the lava and then head back. Some sheep. Get some sheep. I already have sheep. Um, do some work on my farm area and stuff because I recently found a village and I have yet to plant the potatoes and carrots that I found. And like I said, this is an older version of Minecraft. I'm terrible at PvP in this version. I prefer when I have like a buffering so that I can be like, yeah. Like drop down on things and get more damage and stuff. Ooh. Oh wait, oh wait, oh wait, I should probably go check out the fortress and see if I can get any blazes on here. I've made myself lost. Literally made myself lost. Um, I quickly fly around and see where my nether portal is because I completely lost my nether. It goes up here. Mm, no. Oh, here. Found it. Alright, so I'm gonna show you where this nether fortress is, and if you can't guess already, it's marked by torches. <gasps> Usually I fall down a little bit closer. I actually despise soul sand. Oh yeah, here's another drop. Can I get down a different way? Oh, hey, I can. I <laughs> do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. 
I was drunk when I made this path, so it's not really the shortest path I can take, but it is a path to a set of fortress. And the nether fortress was really like small and had and it didn't actually have any nether work in it, which like really ticked me off. I had to go, like I had to fly in creative mode to an entire different fortress and then raid it again, raid the second fortress to get nether wart in survival. And it made me mad. So um, I did not in fact make a path to the second one because all I wanted from there was nether wart, and I got it, and I don't really need it anymore. And there was nothing really good in the chest either, there was like horse armor, gold horse armor, I believe. I do want to try to get some blazes while we're here in the nether. where the path is. anymore. I can put this back on. Load. Done. Back to game. Oh, that looks so much better. Oh, that looks so much better. Look, this thing. I made a ladder up and it causes me like major anxiety because I can't look out that way when I'm going up the ladder. So like I never know where I'm coming out. Yeah, all right. Um, let me just show you how small this fortress is. All right, so this is literally the majority. This is the biggest section. This right here is the biggest part of the nether fortress. <laughs> It's invaded, literally invaded. And then over here, there's like um, a little tiny section, but there's literally nothing here. Ooh, I'm cute. That's not a magnet. <laughs> That's a cute. Um, yeah. Oh, I about this. Go back here. Um, oh, that wasn't very good. That was not very strategic. Oh my god. I'm withered. Being withered in this um, texture pack because you actually can't tell how many hearts you have. Rated that chest. Where is the place? Oh, there's a the place. Um, let's put this. Here. Come with. Come at me. Come at me. Whoa! It can get me through there. Noted.
watching, following me. I think that's enough nether adventures for now, so let's put that in the brewing thing. Alright, it is indeed night, so we should probably sleep. Sleep. Alright, come here, Azura. Look at that nice sunrise. It's beautiful. And why aren't my birch trees loading in? Birch trees, load. I need to get more food. I only have three steaks on me. Food. 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 Yum. I started a cow farm too. Good morning. As here, come on. We're gonna go stand in the flowers. But, yeah, because there used to be like a whole um There used to be a whole like wall here, so I cleared out the wall, surrounded it with leaves so that you couldn't see the dirt, and put flowers along it. And it looks really pretty and very scenic, especially for outros. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you'd like to see more, please be sure to boop that like button and be sure to boop that subscribe button and be sure to turn on notifications so that YouTube actually works and tells you when I upload a new video. Yay! Just a quick note, I have a combined channel with my friend Llama, who you might have guessed is actually the horse over there. I named the horse after Llama. And it's called Llama, it's called Llama Carrot. And we're currently working on getting it set up. So when we start posting videos, I will notify you guys. And you can go over and check that out. Because my friend Lama has a great editor and stuff. And you can find her on YouTube at Tove Longsparrow as well. Uh, she's great. She is actually great. We actually have a club together on Star Stable. We're working on promoting that. We have an amino for the club as well. So you can go check that out. And I'm probably going to have like a little bit of a modded series that will be updated either uploaded today or tomorrow. Um, tomorrow I will be doing a live stream on Instagram of a day in my SSO life because we reached 100 followers! I'm so happy and I'm so thankful to all of you that have been supporting me through this through these hard times. Um, this year was probably my best and worst year, and I'm so thankful for everyone who has stood with me through it. Thank you all so much for watching. Goodbye. Whoops.